All right, guys, today we're going to make this little card holder or placeholder. You can use it for um, weddings, birthdays, card holders, and you put your little card through there. So what you're going to need is some little cups. You're going to need, I would say you'd probably want to anchor something down like this on something heavy like a plate. We do you have different types of plates. Um, we have some silverware. Some where did I put it? Here we go. So some miniature silverware. Some sprinkles. You're gonna need your glue gun, mini glue gun, and a glue and glue sticks. We got pink, white, and brown. So we're going to do both of the pink and the white, pink and the brown and the white, I don't know, is that focusing okay? Um, white raccoon honey at the top. So alright, let's begin. So we, I've had this uh, glue warming up and we are going to use, let's see, use a new cup here. You got this new Sunday glass, kind of like a beer mug, but you can use it for Sunday glass. All right, so be careful because it's very hot. Oh, can you see that? So I'm going to change the color here. So I'll go ahead since that's warm and I'm going to pull that glue stick out and place it to the side on a piece of foil. Alright. Got the brown. Oops. Be careful. It's very hot. We still got some of the pink coming on, that's okay. Just pour towards the center. You might need two brown glue sticks. So it looks like we're going to need another brown. So let's go ahead and put the other brown glue stick in there. And we'll go ahead and fill her up. So you can let that cool down for a little bit. Go ahead and unplug your glue gun because you're not going to need it anymore. And you don't want to burn yourself. Okay. So while that's cooling down, can I peel that off? I guess not. Okay. So while that's cooling down, we got the. This is the floral wire. You can use uh, any kind of wire that can twist. I'm going to use some needle nose pliers here. And I'm going to make a couple loops. Put it through the middle. I'll do it three times. A 
bend it at the end right around here and loosen it up well it slides right off so that's what's going to hold your card like that Okay, it's kind of blurry Okay, anyways, so we are going to get this in here. And we want that to stay in the middle because it will fall side to side if it's not put in right. So get some painter's tape, tape it in the middle on both sides and I, I guess you could put another one because I guess it could put go on that those two other sides so So wait for that to completely cool down or else your whipped cream clay will not stick. Okay, and let's set that off to the side here. Let's see if I can adjust this. Alright, so now we have a couple of other ones. Than earlier. Uh oh, that tape doesn't want to come off. Anyhow, so pretty much you got part here and all you have to do is add your whipped cream so since you're a little bit pressed for time I'm gonna cut the end off here I'm using this honey raccoon clay I already used it so I taped the end real tight with some packing tape all right so Make sure it pipes. Uh oh, piping is not so good. Let's fix that real quick. Ah, uh, let's see. Well, I guess we're just gonna have to go the whipped cream a little bit messy look but it'll be alright. 